Oh, oh the, the crabs are coming up. Are ganging. Oh my god. Wait. I'm getting fucked up. Let them cook. Crab Rangoon. <laughs> right in front of their crab Rangoons. Oh my god. Pick up the jiggy. They really are like the Rangoons, you know what I mean? Like. <laughs> I also really liked this element of the game, where the music kind of shifts to be like a, a subtle muted version depending on where you're inside, or like how they fix the music to change based on where you are. That is absolutely one of the one of the most revolutionary parts of this game is like the dynamic music. It's it's so good. Like how much love and, and care do you need yeah. to be able to pull something like this off? You write a tune, but then also you need to record like six or seven versions of it. Just, just for the atmosphere. Like, that's all. It's not like even like you're recording new songs to get more of the levels done. It's like for the same level, you have to record the same song in a bunch of different ways. Like I want the national anthem to be. Yeah, I think that'd be cool if the national anthem. So like, if you walk to a different part of the room, or, or like if you if you drink some water, it turns into like the water version <laughs> of the national anthem. You're in the washroom, and it's a. Uh... You know, like the the Clanker's Cavern, or like the like the sewer sounding oh, yeah. sound effects. <laughs> You're in the washroom, and your anthem is just <laughs> it's like a really shitty version, but there's a lot of farts and slimes. <laughs> That's what I think of patriotism. Oh. We used to be a real country. We used to be a real. Country. Look, in this great land of Treasure Trove Probe used to be united. Are those his ass cheeks? Uh, banjos? No, I thought the, I think those yeah. were like his legs. The texture is popping in and out a little bit. That's a little, I mean, or it might be an emulation thing or it might just be my eyes. Oh. I'm a fuck up. No, you're not. You're supposed to... Hit, hit the crab and the X at the same time. Big and turn this way and shoot the box. Oh my god, he said, please open me gently, and he fucking exploded. Mm -hmm. No, there's no room for gentleness Absolutely in this game. no room for mercy. It's like the Juju guy from the first level, and you just hit him with an egg, and he shot into... The, like, he just launched into not existing <laughs> yeah. anymore. Coffee and mint stuff. <laughs> Okay, hot take, people aren't going to agree with me for this, but the shark has a great sense of humor. And I'm on the side of the shark. Yeah, you think you should, I should just let the shark eat me all the way? He's earned it. Like, how did he get all the way over here? Okay, what if we entered okay. in the code that erased everything? I think we shouldn't. What were you checking up? Uh, checking on... This is the last thing to do, I'm pretty sure. This is, this is the end of the level. Um, I'm gonna say... R. I don't think so. And... G. Yep, that was it. Uh... G, uh... Hit B again. What are you even trying to spell? Mario 64? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Z. Wait, what? 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 What, what letter am I what? on? Oh my god, I forgot what letter I was on. No! I went into the water early and that messed up my, my juju. Alright, get out Grammarly. We're not losing this again. <laughs> Wait, did I not get the second? Oh my god. If you don't get this, we are not releasing this episode. <laughs> This episode two will be a new game. For episode whatever will be a new We're game. We're probably on three or four right now. This guy's terrifying. Okay, can you beat him in a one-on-one? -on -one, you versus Crab? No. Is he? Did, can you kill him? You can. Okay, he's fine. This guy sucks. Oh my god, he's just bouncing. All they right. gave you one block. One it's block. Stuck. It's stuck. Look at it. I didn't know sticky. that could happen. Can't get it. Yeah, it's, it is, it's, yeah it's, it's honey. Honeycomb. Sticky. Mm -hmm. Let's just erase the game file. Alright. This theme is always like one of my favorites. 
This is pretty good. I like this one. This was a good theme. I wish they'd let you like turn into a shark here though. I think that's a missed opportunity. Yeah. Like like Mumbo should be like such a capitalized on. No, let him be. Let him be. <laughs> no mercy. Just flies into pieces. <laughs> no mercy. In in Banjo Tooie, they do a pretty good job with it. Cause okay, don't they... take his flowers. No, I'm gonna. Or feathers. I, I'm gonna let don't him take his feathers. feathers. I I can tell yeah. he's. He's guarding them. He has yeah. nothing else in his life yeah. than the the feathers. We gotta let him have it. Banjo Tooie has a transformation in every stage. Um, but I honestly don't like playing as transformations in honestly either game, which I feel like kind of a dick saying. But wow, you're kind of a dick. Yeah, I I agree. Welcome back to Dick Plays. We're playing Banjo Kazooie. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm so excited to come up with episode titles for these because <laughs> I'm gonna listen through to like whatever we said the most and make that the episode title or like. We touched Gruntilda's booty. That's a that's a sharp booty. Good job solving that puzzle. Thanks. Clankers I just, cavern. I just threw stuff at the wall. Okay, if you had to use if you had to use Banjo Kazooie references as a pickup line, what would you say? Like if you had to somehow use information you've gained from Banjo Kazooie. Uh, in this hypothetical, am I married to my wife? <laughs> no. Okay, but that makes it way let's harder. Say, okay, okay, let, okay, let's start off with the hypothetical that you were already still married to your wife. It doesn't matter what I say. Okay, so then what would you say if it didn't matter what you could say? So, like, it, she wouldn't get it, is what I'm saying. <laughs> so I could just say whatever. Uh, let me think, let me think. <laughs> the first thing I thought of was, uh, you know how the, one of the, did you ever play Banjo Tooie as well? Yeah. Yeah, I did. So, you know how one of the, one of the bosses is named Mingi Jongo? I will fuck the shit out of that robot, man. <laughs> and everybody thinks that, like, if you pronounce it differently, it's pronounced Minji. And Minj is, like, British for, like, <laughs> Something vagina related, I forget exactly <laughs> what. <laughs> That's the first thing I thought of. Honestly, I love that if given the opportunity, you, you enter with the British angle. It's, it's the British angle for me. So, like, so, uh, something about Minji. She Minji on my Jongo. <laughs> Until you what? Until you what? <laughs> I don't know. There's no third thing to say there. She Minji on my. <laughs> I'll call the cops. <laughs> she, she Minji on my. John. Oh my God! Sped up clanker sounds fucking weird. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Speedrunners do this in all one breath of air. They do go all the way down. I'm gonna try. I think. I'm gonna need air from Gloop. I don't think I'm doing this in one breath. My, my swimming is not good enough. I think you're hitting the inputs. A B okay B A B A B Y B A B B Y B A B R R R. Gloop, give me that, you motherfucker. Okay. The air actually does last a really long time, but. Um... It's still scary. Hi, I'm Gloop. Thanks, Gloop. Gloop is sweet. I heard him. I just heard him talk. He said his name like yeah. a Pokemon. Yeah. I'm. I'm making judicious use of the of the bubbles Holy he's fuck. gonna run okay. out you are going to Bro, steal all the oxygen from he, no he doesn't even need that oxygen he's giving it to me oh my god i can't swim
I love him swimming in the animation of these weird <laughs> off angles. <laughs> Cameraman's crazy for that. Play it safe. Like there's all the notes down here. If we're missing like one note at the end, this is why. Or I have to restart from the very beginning of yep. the save file if you don't get all all the notes. Yeah, your cartridge just gets obliterated. Fifty thousand dollars if you can spend one night in Clinker's Cavern. <laughs> Say it in TikTok voice. Fifty thousand dollars if you can spend one night in Clinker's Cavern. L O L. L O L. The My voices. girlfriend thought she got a present, but really it was Clanker's Cavern. <laughs> Clanker looks kind of nice, though. Like, he's kind of Clanker's Clanker's chill, but, like, if we're talking about, like, this game scaring me as a child, Clanker was another uh, prime, prime suspect here. Like,. When you can't read okay. it and know that he's just like a nice little like Ringo type guy, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. like he looks like a big scary metal shark, but really, yeah. like you can't that's you can't judge like that. You know what I mean? How did I take fall damage from that? <laughs> <laughs> I think um, something that shocked me there is like you got the the gate unlocked just by running into it and hitting it, which like has never worked in any game anywhere else. Well, I did, I did hit it technically, but yes, you're, you're right. It usually shouldn't. Like that shouldn't work. There should be a switch, a switch with the gate's face on it. Yeah. Like this my is me face. trying to eat vegetables right now. This is me trying to eat vegetables. Got a cavity. Need some vegetables. <laughs> oh, I just realized you were hitting the cavity. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe you're getting so many Jinjos around around Clanker. So many Jinjos? Uh, Jiggies. Jiggies? Oops. Yeah. Like it didn't even strike me. There's a way. there's a bunch in inside of him. That's Ow. kind of like what I remember. I just didn't I didn't realize how much was outside of him. What do you think that? That red surface is trying to emulate. Like uh, that texture? What do you think that's supposed to be? Blood cells? Probably. Like, when I see this, I just think, like, what's that one cartoon? Oh, uh, with the, with the white blood cell? Was the... Osmosis Jones? Osmosis Jones, yeah. Yeah, yeah that, 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 all... that Oh my god, fire. I went to the wrong ring. I'm stupid. This is very Osmosis Jones vibes, the, like, looks of it. That movie goes hard. I really need to get love... another watch. Like I never, I don't remember anything about it. Let's just say eyelashes are involved. If you know, you know. I'll remember that when I watch it. The narrator, he completely forgot. By the time I Neither. inevitably watch it, I'll probably have forgotten that we talked about this. So. Or the fact that I'm really hammering it in my head right now. Eyelashes are involved. Now I'm going to remember this probably forever. Now the water's rising. The Kool-Aid looking water's rising. Oh god, the voices. Okay. LOL. So, I was teaching students about... I was teaching students about... Uh, solvents and solutes. Right. I'm familiar and with their work. And I was work. trying to... I was just... <laughs> Very popular pop punk duo, actually. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh my god, how did this he's just stand in there? <laughs> how is he breathing? That's what I want to know. He's so calm, and he's like, "You just rescued Michael Phelps, actually." Yeah. Insane um, lung but, capacity. Yeah. I was teaching them about solutes and solvents, and I was trying to find examples of like things they would have consumed in their like everyday life. That kind of represent what is a solute and what is a solvent. And do you remember Mio? Yes, I do remember Mio. And their phrasing was like squirt some, and it was like the whole point was like you Wait, put it in the water. The, to... Was that the tagline? I didn't remember. Yeah, that. there was. It was like Mio squirt some. I I totally forgot about that. 
But like their whole premise is like the the solute is the mio, and then you put it into water, and then it makes right. it like that makes lemonade or whatever. I'm, I see the vision. And none of them knew what water or what, what, what water, water was. Is. Yeah, none of them knew what, what water, water was. <laughs> I only drink what do you prime. Mean water. <laughs> But yeah, none of them know. So, did Mio fall out of fashion already? Like, is it not a, still a thing? I, I, I don't know how long it ever. I thought it was revolutionary when it came out, but like, I bring it up and like, like kids don't know what it is. Even Nesquik wasn't known by everybody. Is that like a thing that's changed? Nesquik is still a thing. So I don't know. I'm a little shocked. By the yeah, way, I'm gonna go take a speed running trick. I, I fucked it up, but yeah, you don't really need to wait. Go back and do it again. Do it again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go take a. I, I want to be able to have it caught on footage, but I want to go take a, take a whiz really quickly. Okay. Sorry about that. That was my uh, Budweiser moment. Welcome back. Hey, if Budweiser wants to pay us to make these, uh, <laughs> we already got a sponsor.